actually unironically love Barry. <laughs> what is up, YouTube? Welcome back. We're here with more Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood. That's right. We're heading back to Central now, and I'm horrified because the be the good beans, the good traveling beans, don't know about what happened to Hughes, and I'm nervy, nervy, worthy. So let's get straight back into it. But hey, before we get started, you know the vibes. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, leave a comment down below to feed the algorithm. What? On top of all of that, don't forget to check out the Patreon for $5 a month. You can get early access to my reactions, unfiltered, uncensored, and uncut. Let's get it. Yeah. Oh, man, beat. They're Seems back in I central, no! Is going on We're keeping eyes on him? Hey. I don't know. Maybe he ran off again. I mean, that's literally your only job is to watch him, so. What if he's collapsed somewhere again? Thank God. Yeah, leave him. Yes, thank God. I was like, please don't make him one of our sidekicks as we travel. He went all the way up there? Damn, he fast. Country doesn't fit. Oh, there's definitely something off. Have you seen Bradley? Footsteps of a, co a comrade in arms. But this game is boring anyway. Hey, since it's night now, I can go and cut someone up, right? Okay. I actually fucking love Barry. <laughs> I actually unironically love Barry. <laughs> yes, he slaughtered people. <laughs> But he's so cute. He's like a little golden retriever of a soul-bound armor. <laughs> hi! 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 <laughs> You're interested. He's not the only one who's bored. How much longer am I stuck here keeping watch on this guy anyway? leave but if anyone even military personnel outside of our unit sees you they'll have you court-martialed before you can blink all right <laughs> oh, what is it hold it i found myself a girlfriend do you remember what he asked Roy if he could stay because he got a new relationship and Roy's like nope you're coming he already found another girl <laughs> already <laughs> we just got here <laughs> hey do you think this new girl would be fun to cut up come on what do you say I'll need to see your entry visa please Oh, you don't have an entry visa. Oh, you try to play your little gimmick to get free food. You stupid bitch. You think this is the random outskirts? No, this is the this is the capital, bitch. <laughs> Welcome. <laughs> they don't give a fuck about your empty tummy. <laughs> oh yeah, he definitely did. Up by the military offices first. Right. In that case, I think I'll head straight to the Hughes' house and let them know I'm in town. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, God, no. I wonder if Lieutenant Colonel Hughes has put together any more information on the philosophy. Oh, students. no, 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 no. Eli. Yeah. I'm pretty sure Hughes said he was in the court martial office. Hmm. These babies. Dude, I, I actually feel my stomach like turning. I don't. Oh, they're walking past the phone booth. Oh my god. Jessica? 
Hey, Sheska, what's up, girl? Number three, right? It's still a total mess from when I was using it earlier. It's fine. Damn, she's acting... She's acting like when kids got their parents coming into their room and they and they are like, oh shit, I didn't put nothing away. Mom, don't come in. Give me two minutes. <laughs> I can come back later for the keys. Please make sure it's taken care of. Yes, ma'am. Is this Roy Mustang fan fiction? <laughs> she just got hella fanfic in there. Oh, the council meeting's about to start. Uh, Colonel? Perhaps this is none of my business, but... <laughs> I'll keep resting in here. Don't worry about me. <laughs> ah! Oh! Captain Fogger, sir! Good morning! Nice day, isn't it? Good morning to you, <laughs> Poor Sheska. <laughs> I'll bet the colonel twisted your arm, didn't he? Don't worry, I won't tell anyone. Oh, I really appreciate that, sir. He's trying to look for Hugh's killer. He's trying to figure out... Oh my god, he's literally losing sleep and doing everything he can to find out the information that Hugh's got that would have gotten him killed. That way he can figure out who the fuck killed him. <sighs> and also, Shit. he was looking into the Hughes case. Yeah. Mm. You know, I... God. Ugh. Well, I've got tons of work to do. Carry on, Cheska. Dude, yes, I don't want to. No, don't. Just don't show me. Don't show me Winry. Don't show me Ed and Al. Please. I don't want to know what they. No, I don't want to see. It was Envy? Envy was the one inquiring about Roy? And try to figure out what he- Oh, fuck! Oh my god, that didn't even occur to me at- Oh, shit! Good morning, Sheska. Sir? Yeah. Oh, fuck. Damn, he's aging. Aging before hey, our so eyes from the stress. Uh, hey, Armstrong! Laboratory in the Philosopher's Stone. The stone's key ingredients are live humans. Hughes always did enjoy helping other people. Oh, God, please. I hope Ed doesn't blame himself. I hope he doesn't blame himself. My little guilt-ridden bean, dude. He already feels so much guilt for everything that happens in his life. Oh, God. They would! They would! Well, you're not telling them what's kind. <laughs> You've got it all figured out, don't you? I'm almost there. But they're going to find out eventually. Someone's going to end up telling them. Like, they're literally visiting Hugh's family, like, now. <laughs> like, hello? Well, at least Winry is, and then they're going after. Huh? Lieutenant Hawkeye? Hey, guys. It's been a while. <laughs> here in Central. You didn't hear? I was transferred to this branch last month. Great. And you guys? 
What brings you here? Oh God. What are you, what are you? Um, to take over the family business. So, he's not here. I see. Well, that's too bad. Well, that's 100% coming back later and Ed's gonna have a breakdown where he yells at Roy. 100%. I'm calling, I'm calling predictions on that one, Shawnee. You have set up an emotional bag that will get popped like a balloon. That's the same thing Armstrong told him. That's the exact same thing Armstrong told him. Bar for bar. Now you've decided to treat them like children? There's no need for them to know just yet. Fewer obstacles that stand in their way right now. That's right, they will. That's right. I fail to see anything soft about it. It's cruel, Colonel. I can't believe... That's actually a really good point to bring up. Because that means you... They have to feel too betrayed. Like, they have to feel two waves of hurt. The betrayal of someone they trust who lied to their faces boldly and the death of someone they cared about. That is cruel. Oh, shit. <laughs> That's heavy. I believe Hughes is actually gone. Oh, I almost forgot. Oh, if you boys haven't heard already. I'm sure you'll both be glad to know he was promoted. Oh, see, the conversation was so vague that she thought they knew about the actual death. And then Elle said it, and then she's like, oh, shit. <laughs> they didn't know. Oh shit! The other shoe is literally dropping like a minute later. So Roy lied to their faces and a minute later they find out. Holy shit! No! Don't show me her being sad! Don't show me who's his wife being sad. No, not the lieutenant colonel. General Hughes is dead. He was murdered shortly after you were discharged from the hospital, Edward. I'm afraid. have a safe trip. Stop in and give me a shout the next time you make it to Central. Al. I didn't think they would do that this episode, man. I thought the shoe was gonna drop, like... Oh, fuck off. I thought it was gonna make an emotional bang that gets popped later on. <laughs> oh god <laughs> Alicia no <laughs> What do we do? You tell it like it is. You going back. I'm He 
he's gonna go apologize to the to the wife and the vacation. <laughs> Yes, he's taking Remember, responsibility. We, we said we were getting our bodies back no matter what. But if people are going to die because of that, then I don't want mine back. <laughs> These are babies. Oh my god, no, she's just holding the baby. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Um, it hurts even more because none of them are crying because they're like holding it together. Because it's like, this is this fucking wife and daughter, so you need to keep it together for them. And they're just feeling the grief and it hitting them. And they just, they aren't even expressing it. They're just like, okay, yep, just solemn, get through it. I have to make this apology to her. I have to do it. And it's like so much. <laughs> I'm sorry, but there's something I need to talk to you about, if I may. Oh, God. Oh, God. I'm so sorry. <laughs> ...into trouble. Oh. But, you know... I don't think he ever had regrets. That's right. Not any. That's right. You can't let what happened defeat you. If you do, then that means my husband died. Exactly, in vain. exactly. Don't make it so that her husband died without reason. If you give up, that means he died, and the, the the intimidation actually worked. You have to keep pushing on so his death is meaningful. Oh God. <laughs> Guess. You boys have to keep moving forward. Any way you can. Oh my god, she's amazing! Oh god, oh god. It's a baby. Oh god, the soundtrack is gorgeous, but it hurts. Everything hurts. Oh god. I just <laughs> Eat your feelings, little buddy. Eat that fucking steak. Eat your feelings, little buddy. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> that Mr. Hughes would get to try something. <laughs> Wait, <a minute. laughs> Oh, God. We knew this episode was coming. We knew they had to go back to Central at some point. Oh god, I need to like clear my head and shit. One second. Oh god. Oh god, okay. Okay. Alright. Oh, okay. Okay, I need tissue and you're crying. Do you think?
think you discovered anything yet? It's a definite possibility. So what now? Nothing. He's either a born idiot or a clueless hustler. I'm off to gather some more intelligence. Said before about how much nicer it would be if the flame colonel would behave himself. What? What? Yes. What the hell are you doing? Named as the primary suspect in the Brigadier General Hughes murder case. Please come along. Uh, huh? That's absurd! Well, I mean... Envy was dressed as you! Go now. Quickly. But secretly. Right. Uh... It's not very secret if you just announce it in front of the whole, like, fucking, like, dining hall. Everyone knows she's arrested now. What kind of, what kind of secrecy do we have here? <laughs> like, hello? Oh, no! Lust! Lust is who he's dating! Lust is the person he's getting information from! The bona fide idiot! It's him! It's him! Holy shit! I put two and two together! Ah! I fucking- I- Dude, when- when- Oh, man. When he said that he had a girlfriend- A new girlfriend, I was like, okay, whatever. We don't need to know about her. And then sh they were like, oh, what about your new boyfriend? Blah, 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 blah. Get any information? I was like, okay, yeah, whatever. And then they rolled out, and then I was like, wait a second. Earlier, he mentioned girlfriend. They mentioned boyfriend for her. New one, trying to get information out of him. Oh, shit! Two plus two is sometimes four. And other times, it's a headache. <laughs> it's so good to see you, Jean. Why don't you sit down and tell me all about your day? Damn, that's crazy. <laughs> Anyways, thanks for watching YouTube. We'll catch you in the next one. Thanks for your love and support always. And we'll see you in the next one. Goodbye!